Hey, so what? My daddy Bobby OJ. Yeah. My daddy Bobby OJ, so? Yeah, <laughs> Your son a punk. Right. One of them sons gay and the other one retarded. Yeah, one, See? one of his sons kind of weird. One of them sons though. gay. That's the one you try to keep married and push to the back because he's be swishing and shit. Right. And the other one with that big ass Paul Cooper head God. hanging on the back. God. He's slow. But yeah. guess what? Little Daryl get whatever little Daryl want. Daryl Jr. Let me tell you something. Yeah. Darryl he Jr. like he like the little white boy in the toy. God. Hey, if he wants a nigger like Joey to play with, yeah. give him a nigger like Joey. Little Daryl gets everything he wants. By the cut by that suit. You oh, want to yeah. see little Daryl suit? God. Come on. God. All right, should I show listen? Yeah, might as well. I got listen. we got one more scripture too. Thank you, I. And we on some clown shit. But judgment must begin at the house of plus. We want somebody from his church to see this and get offended at the jokes. Right. Because, yes, I call, I don't want to disrespect. We like you, God. but I'm jealous of you. It's eating me alive. God. So I'm coming after you. Facts. I'm jealous. <laughs> and I'm not being sarcastic. I really am jealous right. of you. The name, I be riding past hey, your I house. you living your life, bro. Yeah, you living my life. Yeah. <laughs> I'm like, fuck. They got the spa robe. Right. Got the, the robe. The only thing stuff. I would have on the punk ass equestrian boots you had on. Oh, uh, yeah. Nah. Hey, Daryl, we have counsel about your sexuality. God. Guess what we've determined? This nigga ain't never did shit gay a day in his life. God. The only thing you ever did gay was let your wife talk you into putting them punk ass boots on and talk about you had a legacy. Right. You're not gay. Yo, yo son is. God. You straight as a nail, you, you, you motherfucker, you. <laughs> That's why I want you to be my dad. God, God, God. Hey, I, let, them, let them see that suit, bro. Let them see how, how I know junior, they like this how, nigga crazy. How Junior gets down, bro. This Daryl Hines Jr. Oh my God, look at this. The the suit, I, the suit, man. And we feel so Look insignificant sometimes. Look at the suit. And we feel so. Oh my God! What name is that? That ain't Hugo Boss. No, that but God told Hugo. Israel, and I just read it. He said, Look at him. He said, "Listen." Look at the back of his head, Daryl. You Your son retired. You the I guarantee parents. he had all type of speech lessons when he was a kid. Yeah, he's special. He's special so the first guy. thing you need to know about your promise, write this down. The first thing you need to know is regardless to where you okay. are in your promise, you. regardless to where you are in the process of your promise, know this, that God is always with you. Number okay. one. With a suit like on, I, I can see that. Whenever you yeah. see in the Bible, and I don't have time to go down the list, but whenever you see in the Bible a people of promise, okay. whenever you see in the Bible a okay. person who has promise. great promise, oh, he dropped the ball. Oh, yeah. always hey man, you tripping? God's presence. Hold on, Daryl. Look, look at look at this family. Look at look. I just want to show y'all this 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 beautiful display of wealth. You know what I'm saying? The beautiful look look at him. look at him. Look at him. Is your marriage look. what you've made a sense? Hey. A beautiful display of wealth. But it's just one suit. I just need you to see this suit, man. It's ridiculous. I mean, this one. Oh, look at when this When we think of being filled with the Holy Spirit, we think of look at the suit. a cup being filled with water. But a cup, but that's not a good example of what it means to be filled with the Holy Spirit. A better example is a sail being filled with air. Huh? That word spirit means pneuma, you which means wind. Air. So when we are filled with the Holy Spirit... Our cell is okay. filled with the wind Okay. Now, now that's Daryl Hines Jr., okay? The uh -huh. other son is a flaming punk that they try to sweep it under the rug. Right. This boy like girls. Now, Daryl, this is me showing you respect. We had counsel on your sexuality uh -huh. with weirdos like that. Uh -huh. Why? Because we had to check that. You heard Pimp C said, because he's sick. He said, if you don't watch him, he get AIDS to your bitch. Cause he's sick. With God. all the rings on, but he in the pool pit talking about my rap song. God. Now, you got Eddie Long down in Atlanta. Me, yeah, you know what I'm saying? I get the bitches. You only got one bitch, but you know, I get the bitches. Okay, that's it every Saturday. Hey, me and Creflo, we get the bitches. Yeah, yeah, you and Creflo, his name Michael Johnson. I don't know where Creflo came from. You know that's his real name. I know, yeah, Michael so, Johnson, yeah. Michael Johnson turns into Creflo, and then you transform into a faggot that sleep with 15-year-old boys in your church up the booty. And then God. you friend with this guy. So we had to put you to the test. And guess what, Daryl? You should be proud. When Yashirala Milwaukee stamp show, not faggot card, 
God. Slocky. God. Bundle of sticks. Bundle of sticks. We didn't mean it in a gay connotation. If, if we say, oh, you think this nigga did at least once though? <laughs> and he say, hell no. And I say, no. Hell no. Right. This motherfucker, he, 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 he with the bullshit. Right. You know what I'm saying? He with the bullshit. Right. Hey, if you right. put a dick in the room with this motherfucker, this motherfucker probably lose his mind, jump out the window. Right. But his son gay. Right. <laughs> he hate that motherfucker. <laughs> he right. trying to, he he front. He probably he like Lucius Lyon. He that motherfucker. Right. Hey, little Daryl, I'm gonna buy you a car. Dad, why I can't get a car? You got wait. But it's really because he's gay. <laughs> I don't right. wanna give you what he can give you, little Daryl. <laughs> hey, you don't think we can peep that? Come. Hey, and we're just equivocating. Just know. My nigga, my nigga. Guess what really make me jealous? I want you to be gay. God. And you not. I want to feel you gay. Like, is he gay? Yeah, I, he might have. Yep. Yeah. Ah, 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 I agree. He agree. You got some punk in you. God. But us being the men of truth that we are, you, you, you pass. Now, now that we talking about you. Don't think you could throw anybody else up there with you and say, no, I told you we wasn't gay. No, nigga, we said you. Right. You wasn't gay. Right, right. We believe that. Like It's like the Lord told us, Joey, Rob, make sure you let everybody know this man is not gay. That's yeah. the thing. Yeah, he is a nigga. Right. He the type of nigga that you niggas know about. Right, right. <laughs> the ultimate Negro research. Nigga, dude, uh, if you bring an ugly bitch around him, he probably like, shit, that's his woman. I'm saying, he, he better watch her because she looking at these gamers. <laughs> he that nigga. Yeah, he that nigga, bro. Oh, get on this level. Right, nigga. right, right. You bring a gay motherfucker around him. Yeah. What's up, Pastor? Hey, how you doing? How you doing? Then he go to Pamela and say, this gay ass shit. That we just gotta sit here and watch. God. You know I ain't with that punk ass shit, baby. You always say that. Facts. I'm just saying, fuck that shit. You right, right. right. but you know I can't say nothing. You know, but you know I would, right? right. Fuck that shit. Right. You already know how I get out, baby. I know that's you. Right. When the, when the camera go off. <laughs> right, we gonna get we gonna do it with the camera on. <laughs> yeah, Daryl, we peeped you. The condo by the fan building. The black dude it's who Saint run the Francis. fans. The black dude who y'all friends. Y'all gotta be. It got to be, bro. It's a black dude running the feds over there. I forgot his name. All I gotta do is go to the right. website. Right. You live right there. Y'all know yeah. each other. Y'all have been to some of these luncheons. Hey, man. Yeah, what do you do? No okay. Oh, that's you. Okay. Like that. Hey, your church, we gonna come up there. Okay. We do the black top. Because your, your parking lot is your black asphalt. See, they doing a nigger joke on you. Come. See, they, 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 you keep coating it with black asphalt, right? Yeah. But see, here's what you understand. Asphalt is a nigger joke. Why would they take something that, that's basically a compound of something that would be equivalent to the concrete and cement version of mitts beef, kind of. a sausage, a hot dog? Kind of. You know, that's what kind of a black topish shit is. And he... You, you roll it out and it make everything look good, but it's some bullshit. Some bullshit. And it's your black asphalt. Why is it called asphalt and why is it black? And why every time a Christian get put on the hot seat, it's you. Because it's always your black asphalt that these people are not living the lives that they're supposed to be living. Y'all right. fleecing, man. Y'all fleecing. And we're yes, we're having comic relief at your expense. But uh -huh. just understand that if nobody else has the balls or cares enough to be nerds to follow around clergy and rich people in the city just for kicks and content, God. and for the Lord too. Because judgment must begin at the house of Israel. And you're not telling those people they're Israelites. So we coming after you. Nor is he focused in the name of the Lord. Or are you focusing in the name of the Lord? Your congregation, not your congregation, your top security guard and his son, <laughs> we know the story. They tried to join the church. Our church. How the fuck you gonna leave Daryl Church and join their raggedy motherfucker? Right. Yeah, that's true, bro. That was in. They gonna come in and say, hey, can we take over? 15? Yeah, in 2015, he called me all the time. I was like, damn. He watching the channel. I don't know if he's still watching. We might have got too radical for them. Con. Yeah. They probably was like, yeah, them niggas lost their way. No, we didn't. No, nah, we We better. just look more into what we doing, and we realize, and damn, them Israelites that stand on the corner, they not really going into detail about what's going on around them.
Facts. Okay? Facts. Yeah. We looking and saying, wait a minute, he's connected to Burke? Right. He's connected to Locke. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Daryl Hines was pulled up by the Bishop Committee, and these were the allegations? Yeah. Is there any truth to these allegations? Whoa, his cousin did go to jail? What? Yeah. That means he's guilty. So I. Yeah. Right now, your brother, go and run your wife off the road in Texas. God. But he ain't know it was your wife, and he just happened to be there. And, oh, shit, one-way ticket back to Milwaukee. Wait a minute. So that like hitting the lottery. He was in Texas, right? God. In the rental. Right, with a one-way ticket back to Milwaukee. God. Where was you going in the rental? I'm, I'm just, you know. And you ran into your cousin, girlfriend, and ran her off the road and didn't stop. And then ran back to the airport with the one-way ticket. Yeah, that wasn't on purpose. No, man, that's the crazy thing about it. Right. I was down there. I ain't gonna lie. I was down there on some bullshit. I've been getting some weed. You know, I've been a couple pounds of weed. That's what the rental was for. Okay. And the ticket, I was gonna smuggle it back on the plane. But see, it was this bitch who cut me off on the highway. And the bitch hit me. And next thing I'm like, damn, I gotta go. Because I ain't wanna get, you know what I'm saying? And then when I found out it was Daryl bitch that he wanted killed, right. I said, damn, that's fucked up. How I get caught up in this bullshit? I go out here to get some weed. And I fuck around and run into the bitch that you won't kill. I had to hurry up and come back. I didn't even know. I was trying to get away from the accident. And then come to find out it's my cousin, bitch, that he won't dead. And I don't hit this bitch. Right. <laughs> and now I'm at the right. airport right. with a with a one-way ticket. Uh, how you get here? Uh drove. Yeah. But you got a one-way ticket. Ah. Oh. You're fucked, dude. You're fucked. So yeah, you can get out the bishop board. Right. You're rich enough for your bum ass cousin to take the case for you. That's exactly what happened. And it's documented. Tuesday, you left your gate open. And this is exactly what I was finna do. I'm finna bust that turn up in your shit. God. Not because I'm I'm jealous of you and I want to see how nice your house is. Not to rob you. Everybody knows that that's not what I do. I can give you one hell of a haircut too. God. So I just wanted to see the opulence. Beautiful word, yeah. Because the gate always closed and we can't see your house. I can see Alex Lazarus shit. You can walk up to yeah, it. Yeah, I can see, you know, John Slipsky shit. It's nice. Right. I can see, you know what I'm saying, Buzz Selig shit. You know? Yeah. We see these houses. We like, damn, these motherfuckers billionaires. What Daryl living like? Can't see. Let's go on Google Earth. Can't see. Can't see. What the right. Syndic's family living like? Oh, they showing everything. everything. Damn. Everything. They showing everything? Yeah, they every, everybody. Why would you go on Google Earth? Daryl shit blurked out. Well... He don't yeah. want you to see. wait a minute, man. Can we get a look at the fabulous life? Can I get a glance, Daryl? All I want to see is, damn, that motherfucker is nice. Busting. Yeah. Can't see nothing. Can't see a deer from the rear. But you left your gate open. Absolutely. Who left? Who the fuck left the gate open? It was. Guess what my brother said. He said, "Hey, I." <laughs> did what he said? What? What if the gate wasn't left open? What if it was left over for you? <laughs> right. And he's like, fuck this motherfucker. Let's see if he bold enough to drive up in this bitch. Right. I was. Hey, I think you should understand by my demonstration, our demonstration yeah. at Fires Reform, ain't nobody scared of no motherfucking Daryl Hine no. or some nigga. No. We would have drove up in your shit yeah. and asked you, is it for sale? All in this kitchen in this fridge. Right. We would drove right shit. to that motherfucker like, hey, man, I, I got a package coming. I live next door. <laughs> what? The nigga, nigga don't live next door. I'm just yeah. fucking with you. I hit the wrong street. It ain't even no house next door. You right. Know what I'm like, man, the GPS said turn right here. <laughs> the gate was open. It did say nobody could enter. Right. So I drove in and we're like, man, it's somebody out. I was looking for the Silverado Memory Care Center. Good. You know, the Silverado Memory Care Center that's yeah. right there? Yeah. I had that in. And it said, turn right here. I said, Silk, this don't look like silver. I went in. It was your house. I want to see that house. I just want to see what to drop. Google, why you, come on, man. Put it on Google Earth, man, so we can see. I'm going to see the condo. God, God. <laughs> I'm going to see your building on 7th and Layton. God. And I'm going to see the condo. And, and at some point, I'm going to make my way around to these properties. Let's see. And I'm going to put the properties up. So I know a lot of black people, they don't want to do nothing. And the bro Ock wants to finish. And we will be very shortly. He got, but let's like see. at least... What, 10, 14, 15? Let me show the church. Please. Let's see. This is what CFFC owns. So let's go ahead and let the people, if you want a screenshot, God. here are God. the properties. Remember, you can stop the camera. Right. Here are the properties listed the address that are in the names of Christian Faith Fellowship Church. Here are the address. Remember, you can pause it. You can, you can pause it if you want to look them up yourself. So see right there where it says, 
8605 West Good Hope. Look right here. See how I got them four 11s right there? It's a 11 11. <laughs> right. God. Ooh, Daryl, if you a Mason and you know what they doing to you, 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 you fucked up, fucked up. But if they doing this to you and using you and making you rich to make you look like a fool in the long run on Judgment Day, and I peeped it, and you don't understand that we living in the Matrix, you're fucked. <laughs> but those are his properties. And I will make it a point to make it around to every property, God. see what condition it's in, see if it's being maintenanced, seeing if it's being lived in or rented out for commercial purposes. Right. Find out what the businesses are. Find out who rents them. What's the rate? How yeah. much they charge? Absolutely. What they selling? You know what I'm saying? Absolutely. And uh, and, and your condo? And what bitches you fucking? Cause you fucking bitches. Yeah. Well, you remember, Pam? Remember I'm sorry the, to tell you. The scandal you was just saying. I'm sorry to tell you, Pam. But, but you already know. Yeah, she got the husband. Know. He's he's a he's what Kevin Samuels considers a a a. Uh, of a high value male. Yeah. And he's he's like marrying an NBA player. Oh, absolutely. So yeah. when you marry a high value man, part of it is he get bitches. Right, that's part of the perk. Just be glad he don't like ass. Right. <laughs> that man like that pussy, boy. Right. He like it from the front. He like that pussy. That's what I don't like about him. Okay. I want to be a fag. <laughs> You know how we always can be like, ah, let's look at this guy. Hey, ah, right. look at this guy. This nigga, ee. When you look at him, you're like, fuck him. Hey, hey, <laughs> hey, this nigga like, hey, man, I'm such a player. Right. Eyes a player. Uh, 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 I had to hear your name all the time growing up in church. It's Daryl Hines. What the fuck? It's Daryl. It's Lil Daryl. It's right. Lil, Lil Daryl retarded. Right. Ricky Smiley, Lil Daryl retarded. And Daryl Hines Jr. is, is you know, Retarded, like right. like little little Daryl, right. <laughs> little Daryl retarded. But I envy you. I'm jealous. I don't hate you. God. I don't. You funny to me actually, but I am jealous of you. Already. I'm not jealous to the point where I want to cause bodily harm to you. No, I'm jealous because I'm like, hey man, hook me up to people you hooked up with, and we want to teach this and get those benefits. Right. Yeah. How we hook that up? Maybe we could sit down and you could tell me how I could put my church together to teach this. Right. But but we have that as as an outcome. Right. Come, come. I'm gonna get I'm gonna hit them with this. I'm gonna hit them with this uh, as we get ready to close it up. Ephesians, but well Philippians 319. Whose end is destruction, whose God is their belly, and whose glory is in their shame, who mind earthly things. That's due. Right. Let me let me tell you something, Daryl. And I know you know about this. The Lord's name ain't God. It's Yahweh. Yahweh. And I know you know that. You heard. Come on. Yeah. Bro, you can't tell me that you don't do no studying or no watching your back in the spirit. Or at least stumble across. Right. You have to. If you're in this situation, you just can't be hully gully. You got to be looking out for personal attacks. Right. Motherfuckers who calling you out on your bullshit. That's, that's your image. Your image can be tarnished mm. by something like this. God. See? So you mean to tell me that nobody has sat up and said, what you think about these Hebrew Israelites? You kicked some Hebrew Israelites out your church that you were supposed to be best friends with. Right, because he, he found out he was trying to break bread with us. What you were supposed to do was say, hey, brother, you know, if that's what you want to believe, that's cool. You don't have to leave the church. Everybody's welcome. And say sinners welcome. Oh, right. you took that sign down. Right. No, only niggas. Oh, are... only niggas that agree with me is welcome. There you go. So... If you say, man, you know, I kind of think about Hebrew, like, it's your job to be like, uh-uh, brother. Let's go through this. Right. Them demons on you. No, you kick these people out right. and said, security, them, make sure them. they never come back because they the teaching world. a false doctrine. Yeah, okay. Send them, send them Why you world. didn't try to help them? Why you didn't say, hey, matter of fact, this, this Sunday, that sermon coming out. Hey, if them Hebrew Israelites step to y'all, ignore them. That's what they do. They go around and harass Christians because they jealous. We got to the glory. That's what you're right. supposed to do. But right. you kept it hush hush. Why? God. That's what I would do if I was a Christian. What? Yeah. Some Hebrew? Uh uh. Absolutely. Not to my congregation. Sunday? Hey. These Hebrew Israelites running around this motherfucker? If y'all want to talk to them, talk to them. Them motherfuckers sending you off. I don't, I don't mess with them. Right. And it's probably some of y'all believe that in here. But just know God. And I'm going to start teaching my shit. 
But I'm going to make sure I always bring up them Hebrew Israelites. Damn, I lost some motherfuckers to them. And then if I don't know, I'm going to study. And when I study, all it's going to do is make me talk about y'all more. If I see y'all infiltrating my best friend, you don't say nothing. Absolutely. You just out the back door. And no, no, no. But see, we got phone calls from that situation. Yeah. A two bum ass nigga. Already. Yeah. What? Them bum ass niggas? Yeah. Intel. Why are they telling them that? Well, they got the truth. You teaching lies. Lies. The Lord had to throw a monkey wrench in your shit. <laughs> and, and, and your, your kind. Of, I still had a picture of them guys. They had fringes on. Okay. The father and the son. Okay. Your top security guard, who was your best friend. Went everywhere with you. Top flight. And his son, all of a sudden, hey, you're out. Damn, you're out. So I can fuck a bitch and then it's counseling. I can do some gay shit and it's counseling. Man, you know, we think about this Hebrew Israelite thing. You're out. <laughs> no right. help. No help for a sinner on that one. No. Nah, bro. What about Muslim? If I decide, I, you know, I mean, where do you help people and then where do you kick them out? Obviously, if they say they're a Hebrew Israelite, they got to go. <laughs> yeah, they got to go. But anything yeah. else? We can fair, work on that. Game. You beat the shit out your bitch, DeMonte. I'm talking about to the point to where she's blind and fucked up. We can work through that. God, you know, ridiculous. you got mad. That's ridiculous. You know what I'm saying? Too. But you a Hebrew Israelite. Oh, no, you got to go. That's <laughs> ridiculous, bro. But you, see, I know a little something about you. My father-in-law live across the street. God. I used to sit there and look at that motherfucker like, man. <laughs> yeah. Mighty fine operation you got going. <laughs> It's on you, bro, man. You, you, you close out when you done. When you finish your point, you, you close this out, man. I'm, I'm, I'm spent, man. I'm whooped. Hey, y'all, the elder is, man, listen. You got to give him his flowers, man. He, he did his thing today, man. You know, he let you know. This guy living delicious here by the name of Daryl Hines Sr. And the lifestyle he got, we supposed to have that. We supposed to have that. We putting in the real work. He putting in the fake work. And, and he got the congregation treating him like he the biggest thing since ice cream. Ain't edified nam soul in there. Ain't set them up for nam way of salvation by way of salvation. He ain't even preaching the name. He ain't even giving y'all, he ain't even giving the congregation the name. He, they, they celebrate. He him. Right, not only that, he teaching them Christmas. Yeah. Like, as if Jeremiah. Oh, Merry Christmas like it ain't nothing. Yeah, yeah. Eating poke. Yep. You know, you know that Christmas ham probably came from Syndix. Yeah. Yeah. It's the best grocery store. They right over here. They with them. They probably at the thing. Right. Hey, stop by. Hey, we got to stop by the Heinz's. Yeah. Oh, so the Ballesteries are going to stop by. Yeah, just for a minute. Yeah. You know, it's cordial to stop by. We gave them ham. <laughs> <laughs> Him and little Daryl went to school together, but my son went to prison. God. Little Daryl started preaching, and the Ballesteri kid went to prison. God. God. <laughs> okay, this is to close out on Matthew chapter 7, verse 15. Beware of false prophets God. which come to you in sheep's clothing, but inwardly they're ravenous wolves. Daryl, <laughs> oh. ye shall know them by them gators, them fruity ass gators. They fruits, right. they alligator fruities. Now later, he got the now later gators on. That's your fruits because those yeah. gators that you wear are your fruits. Hundreds of dollars in shoes. God, God. Do men gather grapes of thorns and figs of thistles? Hey, do niggas like Joy and Rob? When they worried about preaching the word, is they worried about hitting you with the shoe cam, hitting you with the garment cam? Nah, you know what I'm saying? Man, chilling, man. Standing behind a glass Filthy podium rags, so you can man. see hit a shoe when they go to stun, not using the Bible, but minimizing the Bible by using an iPad. Kind. So it'll be, get this out the way, this big buck, you're going to block my outfit. Right. But right. see this thin iPad right here? Kind. It ain't going to block my outfit, none. Kind. Matter of fact, this is going to add to it. I'm rich. Facts. A Bible cheat. I got the iPad. Joey and Rob got to use their cell phone. Already. <laughs> Already, So, bro. ye shall know them by their fruits. Do men gather grapes of thorns and figs of thistle? God. Even so, every good tree bringeth forth good fruit, but a corrupt tree bringeth forth evil fruit. How do we know? You celebrating Christmas and you having a Christmas party. That probably why your gate was open. Facts. And if you're not having a Christmas party at your house... We on your Instagram, and it say Merry Christmas. You in your 60s. Facts. That's a lie. That's your fruit. You're Facts. evil. Absolutely. Kind. Kind. A good tree cannot bring forth evil fruit. Neither can a corrupt tree bring forth good fruit. Right. We, we, we don't bring forth corrupt fruit. Kind. 
We tell the truth. Christmas evil. It's wicked. We not fucking with it. It's Christmas Eve. Fuck you. Already. Fuck Christmas and Bing Crosby. Facts. Facts. God. Every tree that bringeth not forth good fruit is hewn down and cast into the fire. God. What are we waiting for? So, we may die before you, Absolutely. but the Lord has already put your display. Full so, display. we know how you going to end, even if we die first. Yeah. You're going to get destroyed. God, I, I, the Lord going to weird out Yankovic. He's going to weird out Yankovic, you. <laughs> he going to fuck you up. <laughs> Got the fake Jews protecting you. Right, great drink. Running around with Michelle Obama. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Tyler Perry. Tyler Perry. CC Wines. Donald Wines. Donald Trump. Donald Trump. Hey. DTZ. You know what I'm saying? I mean, you made it, my nigga. You made it. Right. But did you make it? Because right. see, the Bible talk about your rich ass. You better be able to go through a real, real small door. Because see, you know, you know, Christian preachers, y'all lie. Y'all right. say a pen and a rich man. No. It's talking about a camel's door. Yeah, a camel. A dromedary door. camel. Come. All you dumb Christians, you know what a dromedary camel is? Well, it's a camel that holds water in his back. Come. And when that water is full, he can't squeeze out that hole. Come. Right. The pin. Right. The hole for the camel. Right. But if he lose a lot of weight, get dehydrated, right. and damn near basically about to die, he that might. motherfucker can squeeze through that hole half dead. Right. And guess what? He have a better shot than you, nigga. Here go a Christian. You know how a pen is? Is this getting a pen and a needle is? How hard it is. That's not what it's talking about. Con. Am I right, right? Facts. I mean, correct me if I'm wrong. Facts. I believe you What right, is it bro. talking about? It's talking about the camel. The Con. dromedary camel. Con. And the door. Con. Con. No, no. I hate crap. Hey. Daryl. I'm jealous, man. I'm jealous. I'm like my father. You know, Howard Shy jealous too. I'm trying to present how he jealous. You're a player, right? You're Howard Shy. I understand jealousy now. See, I, I used to be the type of black man be like, man, you can't admit you're jealous. Cause. People gonna lose their mind. Guess right. what, bro? It's okay to admit I'm jealous. I'm jealous of you. Cause, cause, cause. But my father jealous of Satan when he can when Satan can manipulate niggas like you too. Fact. Didn't he say he was jealous? My jealousy is being spoken through him. You don't deserve your lifestyle, bro. Right, that's us, bro. That's us. We put the work in. We put the work in. And you just dog do, show up every Sunday and right. do that bullshit. Great drink got you up and, there. And get delicious. Right. It's like get that's paid bullshit. deliciously, bro. You and you 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 got money to put a mink on. You won't even go in the corner. Right. Right. All praises to your howl <laughs> while your howl shines. On Christmas Eve. Ain't that something? Christmas Eve. I, hey, man, I, hope, all, I hope all y'all presents go the way that y'all need. But Daryl, I hope your Christmas suck. God. I hope your wife cuss you out. The Christmas tree catch on fire. God. You know what I'm saying? God. Your son say, Dad! He just get up at the dinner with the neighbors there. Dad, when are you going to accept the fact that I'm a homosexual? Uh, ass <laughs> you got me running around with this woman. You know I don't want this woman. I'm not little Daryl. <laughs> right. I'm my own man and I'm gay. <laughs> That's what I want your son to come God. on out with I'm at the Christmas si dinner. Hey, I'm the battle si scary leave and be like, holy shit. Hey, I, we knew that kid we knew he was gay since he was a kid. His, that one. <laughs> his son, his son would say, I'm Sodom. Right, I'm Sodom, Dad. You have to accept it. <laughs> Mom does. <laughs> 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 oh man! <laughs> if he see this, he gonna be mad as a son of a bitch. <laughs> hey, I want that video took down now. <laughs> right, right, right. Hey, that motherfucker. He said my gate was open and it was. That means he really rolled past it. Yeah, yeah he ain't gonna do nothing. Fuck that. Yeah. He too close. Yeah. <laughs> he gonna be mad, mad. Yeah. If they show you this and you see this, you that that's gonna make you mad because you know that motherfucker is gay. Right, right. <laughs> Little Daryl ain't gay. Little Daryl just like your shy. He were Retarded though. Right. You like Daryl, you gotta put the dick in the front. Like Dad, I was trying, ass nigga. <laughs> <laughs> Man, you know I can't give your brother this shit. Yeah. You know your brother got caught doing I know. I know. Uh, I don't like that shit neither. Yeah. Right. We, we men over here. Everybody laughing at us because of this nigga. Facts. Fact though. Fact <laughs> What's the other son's name? Gay Daryl. Yeah, it's this Daryl <laughs> Jr. and then it's uh, 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 senior, okay. what is it? Senior, junior, and the third. Uh, I think it's the second or the third. It's like three. It's the, three the, of them. The one, the one that little Daryl staring far away from in the picture. Yeah. He like that. 
You stand in the middle. Lil Daryl, you stand in the front. This punk ass motherfucker gonna stand over here. God. He my son, man. He my son. God. I mean, God. he married, so everybody don't know he gay. Yeah, huh? Joey and Rob do. Facts. Guess how I know? Remember when I told you my wife was smarter than your wife? Man, I don't think I don't think they know who I'm married to. They don't. They don't wanna know. They don't know. They don't Bro, wanna, they I'm married wanna... to Superwoman. Facts. I ain't lying. God. I just don't brag about it. God. When Superwoman got that, bro, a prophet married to a prophetess. You ain't know that? God. You and your wife, nigga. She, she, she can't do what my wife do. It's what my wife said. <laughs> He's gay. <laughs> Which one? Did, well, how, huh? Him. I said, no, he ain't. Out the gate. Uh-huh. I said, how you know? Ah, he is. Out the you gate. You know him? Mm-mm. She always talking shit. Then I started looking at him. You motherfucker. How you be knowing? I, I'm a prophetess. God, <laughs> so God, I'm gay. God. And my, if, if she, if he ain't, I'm gonna blame my wife because she the one told me. God. No, she don't know him. She just looked at some pictures and like some videos. She said him, he's gay. Already. There was his wife, babe. He's not gay. Uh huh? He gay. Already. <laughs> I don't know. With the wife. I don't know. God. I don't know. Hey, I'm just hey. I'm throwing my wife under the bus. She said that. <laughs> what if we was right? What if my wife, this motherfucker at home, he mad? What the fuck, really? Like he really How do they mad. know that? Like he really mad. Yeah. We, we spirit eavesdropping. Remember, judgment must begin at the house of Israel. You got the biggest house of Israel. All day. All praises to Yahweh. Why Yahweh shy? Con. Hey, fuck Christianity and Christmas. Con. 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 Call Halayim Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh shy. This was comedic. Because Christmas Eve is comedic. Con. Con. God. All praises to Yahweh, Hashem, Yahweh, Shai, Hashem, and Kadak. I don't know. I don't know, man. I don't care. Shalom. Shalom.